how he just felt like things were off from the very beginning going into the game and that the team just wasn't mentally there. Uh, what was your observation of I was right about that. I, you know, I've never been a part of one like this where we just quit competing and, you know, it's so discouraging. Miss shots early. It affected our energy all over the floor. After playing a game last week, a couple days ago in Indiana, where the shot wasn't falling in, but man, we competed and guarded and rebounded and followed the game plan. Today, it was just, we were completely out of it. It's embarrassing, it's humiliating, and got to find a way to fix it. But it's uh, very, very discouraging what I saw out there as a group collectively. You know, I thought Wilhelm fought his ass off out there. I thought he was battling. You know, we'll get a scan on him tomorrow to see, uh, see the extent of the injury. But, you know, I mean, got to get back at it. Got a top 15 team that we're playing basically on the road on Saturday. And it's just unacceptable. It can't happen. See any warning signs for something like this happening? I mean, was this the I didn't. I mean, you know, we had guys that didn't practice the last couple of days with, uh, you know, sinus infections. They were all tested. They all tested negative. We've got one not here um, that's redshirting this year because of an influenza um, diagnosis. Still can't affect it. I mean, you know, listen, I, you know, I could sit here and pretend I was a very good player, but you know, if my shot wasn't falling, I was going to run through a wall and find a way to impact the game. And we had no fight, just no fight tonight. And that's that's the thing that just it's it's uh, it's very disheartening. How do you, uh, maybe this isn't an easy answer. How do you find good guys to? Well, fight? we're going to get out there and we're going to compete on Thursday, and we're going to find guys that want to go out and play hard. Lineup adjustments, or where do you go first? We'll see. We'll see how we'll see how we compete the next couple of days of practice. Point shooting, is there a point that you get to where you just change the way you play offensively? God, we talked about that in the locker room. I mean, it's, uh, I don't know, our shots early were great. I mean, there's no no doubt about it. KSA hits two of them. We have probably five or six other wide open looks, and those don't go down. And, you know, th those are deflating, but it can affect your effort on the other end. You guys, your team's been pretty good at handling adversity. I guess, why does it seem like lately? Take one punch and well, you know, again, Indiana. I thought we competed as, <clears throat> you know, maybe as well as we had all year, especially on the defensive end. And tonight, the again, the lack of shot making, <clears throat> it just completely affected everything. It just sucked the air out of the, out of the building. And, you know, again, that's the true test of, the type of year you're going to have is how you handle adversity. We have handled it, pretty well for the most part. Tonight, was about as bad as as I've, ever been a part of as far as handling adversity. Sometimes strategically <clears throat> help off guys uh, at the three point line to help in other places. How many of those the three pointers that they got were that as opposed well, I to? Like I said, our rotations were phenomenal the other night. Tonight they weren't. I know it's only December 7th, but how concerned are you about this thing getting even worse going forward? Well, again, I mean, if you sit here and hang your heads and feel sorry for yourself, it's going to get a lot worse. So, you know, ain't nobody going to feel sorry for us. We've got to bounce back with two energetic days and put this one behind us and hopefully it was a one one time deal. I mean stylistically you, you consider slowing down or anything like that? How does, I'm gonna that I'm gonna consider everything the next two days. What do you think uh, the way that Alonzo played? Yeah, I thought Alonzo scored it well. I thought he had some pop to him out there. I thought he made really good plays early trying to get other guys involved and um, obviously he scored the ball very well and efficiently in the paint. Uh, you know again it, just got to keep kicking them out. Again, you make those shots early. Who knows? Maybe it's a completely different game as far as your energy is concerned. But it just it just completely deflated us tonight.